Okay, so how to win in judo. It's David Shoemaker here. All right. Um, well, go to practice. <laughs> That's a big deal. Uh, I've been in judo about seven years now. Uh, you know, you got your Kazusuke Gake, you know, off balance, body positioning, follow through. I think the most important thing of that with that is to follow through. The practice will take care of the, you know, the Kazush and the, um, you know, the body positioning, you know, the off balance and body positioning. But the commitment, actual follow through, you can learn how to follow through at practice, but the follow through is a mindset. Commit and follow through. That that's the that's the hardest part, and I found that's the hardest part for me. Um, and I actually got a shirt on right now with you can see the, the throw on there. That guy's following through. He's committing to his throw, and you can see that clearly in the picture. Anyway, um, do that. You have to follow through because that's that's where the wind comes into place. I mean, you can get somebody off balance, you can get them loaded up, but can you follow through? That's the thing. So work on your follow through. That's how you win. And focus on the follow through. Start from the starting point to the ending point. And because going to practice, I can, I've, I you know I'm a brown second degree. I've, I've been in there a while. I'm not great, but I'm okay. Um, and that's the thing I've, again, I've had the most problems with is the follow through because I, I fight bigger guys all the time and the commitment to that throw because you're scared of what the possible outcome could be, you have to commit. And that's what's held me back. I I got really good and then that was that was my my bouncing point. I, I started bouncing against the wall because I I and I'm just now getting better at it is following through. Anyway, I figured I'd throw that up there. Um if you want to know more of what I do, just go to the button below or more in the description. Anyway, have a good one.